Okay, today we are doing arts and crafts. Now, I've had a few videos in the past where I've done like DIY things and I like doing them because everybody else on the internet is doing them, but I actually don't ever research the instructions beforehand, which makes mine really interesting. So today we're doing tattoo tights. I bought these These tights that from like Target and they're really cheap so I can experiment on them before I ruin my expensive tights. So these are the old lady like sheer legs. I don't know. I just bought a new one. So let's get started. So since I really don't know what I'm doing, I have my tights and I have this Sharpie marker since I used to like drawing on my pants a lot when I was a kid. And I've tried all sorts of things, and Sharpie seems to be the most permanent, non-bleedy, and non-washable. I have this eyeliner pencil, I guess, to mark where I want my design to be, and hopefully it'll wash off. And I have my art, which I drew up right here. Ignore those, those were mistakes. And my inspiration was from Pinterest. I just went on there and I searched owl tattoo and I came up with this one which I sort of copied-ish but not really because there's just too much detail and I got lazy. So here is my design so let's get started and see how this works. I've also found this oatmeal container in my house, whoa, because this is sort of like how big my leg is-ish I guess. I don't know. Hopefully it'll work. If not, we gonna learn something today. So first thing, I'm gonna open these. Oh, gross. I also really don't like wearing tights, so this is gonna be real fun. Okay, so what I did was I put the tights on, but not really, because I don't like wearing tights, and then I marked where I wanted the design. So here and here. Now, I guess I'm going to put the tights on this thing, but first I'm going to take my design onto my thing, and it doesn't actually fit. Fit. It's a little bit out. It's a little bit big. So, whoops. Yeah. So I guess this is the best it's gonna get. It's just gonna hang off a little bit on the top, so you can see like the inside of the oatmeal container. But. up the bottom line but I seem to have lost the top line so yeah I'm just going to not worry about it oh well okay so I totally lost the line that I made up top and since I don't feel like putting these on again I'm just gonna do it like this. I don't care, really. I got another pair and I got another leg to try this on, so let's go. So what I've been doing is I've just been kind of gently coloring it a little bit.
Right, so now I'm just, since I untied everything, I'm just gonna separate it from the can, put it on, and see what we got. This is so exciting, and it took way longer than I anticipated, and I'm never doing this again. Well, I will, because if this doesn't work out, I'm gonna try again, because I have so many pairs of tights, but I really hope it does work out the first time, so I don't have to do this again. This is my art that I drew. It actually looks kind of pretty. All right, guys, this is the design by itself. It's so cute. I am so proud of myself. But we have to see what it looks like when it's on my leg, because just because it looks cute here doesn't mean it's going to come out the right way when I wear it. But I'm pretty pleased already. Like, this is really cute. Go me! And I should mention that I don't know how to draw, so this is a humongous accomplishment. Okay, are you ready? I'm so excited. They actually turned out really great! So here it is! My first tattoo tight. It didn't turn out too bad. I'm actually really excited. So that was totally awesome. I can't believe it worked out. Oh my god. I still have one more pair and I have the blank leg that I haven't used yet. So I'm totally going to do some more designs and then I cannot wait to start on my expensive tights. But the thing is, this is a fine point Sharpie, but it's really the normal kind. I think that next time I'm going to invest in the really, really, really fine tip, like the micro tip ones, the ones that are like really skinny, um, try to get a finer line because if you saw the lines are a little thick, which is fine. Um, however, if I were to do any designs with more fine detailing, I wouldn't want the outline to be so thick. Is that the right word? I don't know, but I am so happy that it worked out and I can't wait to have my own collection of tattoo tights.